Hello friends, welcome back. As I had briefed you in the previous episode about the various factors that influence the shape and size of the equatorial platform. Now with those understanding and some calculations that we had performed, let's do the final design loop. So people who are very thorough with the 3D designing and would not like to go through the whole process, I would request you to please skip to the last part of the video. The timeline of the chapters are in the video description. So we are changing here some of the dimensions just to optimize.
So now you can see how our equatorial platform has turned out. I have also put a mock-up of my 8-inch GSO Dobsonian just for reference so that you can have an idea about the size of the equatorial platform in reference to a 8-inch Dobsonian telescope. Here are some of the glints of the next episode. I hope you are liking the series. Stay tuned, subscribe to my channel, like, share and clear skies. Bye bye.